Are we going to get an update from Frank Warren's camp regarding uh, Fury and Music? Somehow I doubt Let me it, tell you Simon. Something. If he doesn't take this fight, Fury, he should be ashamed of himself. Yeah. That's how strong it should be because we've had to listen to a lot of nonsense. We've been very critical of other fighters. We've called out people like Anthony Joshua. We've made observations about other promoters and, and put their feet to the fire. Yeah. If Frank, and, and more to the point, his fighter, with all the noise that goes with Tyson, does not take this fight, then he should be ashamed of himself. Well, especially after what U6 promoter Alexander Krasiu told us. Yeah. Okay, 50-50, that get bombed out. Then we looked at 60-40, the winner taking 60, the loser 40, and they didn't go for that either. We, get lots of, we give lots of praise to Fury. We've had lots of criticism of Joshua. We went down on Fury's side. Constantly, constantly Tyson gets the good word. This isn't good enough. The fight against Chisora wasn't good enough. And if he doesn't take this fight and he ducks this fight, yeah. he starts moving into the territory of the very things that he's very vocal of accusing other people of. Incidentally, I hear in the grapevine that you and Eddie Hearn go at each other's throats a bit now and again. Uh, there could be an opportunity in the coming days for you and Eddie to be in here together with me. You up for that? Well, yes. If, he, if, if, we, if we're prepared to give him an opportunity to come to a big audience on our show, then why not? <laughs> Eddie, if you're listening, the door is open. You're always welcome. I think that will happen in the coming days. When we hear, you will be hearing as well. Jim White and Simon Jordan. Monday to Friday mornings from 10 on AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app and on your smart speaker. TalkSport.